Hi everyone, welcome to Key to Blogging and in this video I will show you how you can lazy load your Google Analytics account in WordPress website. So before that let me just go to the website and copy the website URL and let me just open the PageSpeed Insight tool. So I will click on here and I will enter the website URL and click on analyze the website. Okay. Now let's scroll down and as you can see the speed is around 59 and when I scroll down and search for reduce on your JavaScript it will show a error like Google Analytics. So you can easily fix this and improve your website loading speed by implementing the lazy load analytics code. So for this I will go to my WordPress dashboard and here I will select this option header footer code manager or you can use your own code manager plugin so i have used this plugin to insert the code in the footer section so what i can do is just replace this code with the new code so here my google analytics id is here g to 9c so i will copy this code from here and i will delete the whole code from here now i will replace the code with this one so i will replace the analytics code like this and again i will replace the analytics code here now i will copy all code and i will paste it here now i can select the javascript and keep the site display to side wide and set the location to footer and i will click on update Okay, now our lazy load Google Analytics ID is added. Let me just refresh this page again. And let me just go to the page speed inside tool and let me just reanalyze analyze the page again. Okay, let me just scroll down and search for this option reduce on your JavaScript. And as you can see, the analytics error is gone. So in this way, you can lazy load your Google Analytics account and improve your block loading speed. And whenever someone land on your web page, it will not load the Google Analytics account unless he or she scroll down the page. So in this way, you can improve your blog loading speed by lazy loading the Analytics account. And if you have any doubt regarding this, then you can ask me in the comment section. And if this video is helpful to you, then make sure to hit the like button and do subscribe key to blogging. Thank you.